Well, we ended last episode on a high note. We saw Xion was waking up, so hopefully the resurrection was successful. Gobzo and a lot of our beloved citizens are back, but with it being happy and fun, we're also going to have dark and disparity really soon. I know that from anime, so we'll see what happens. What's up, Dapper Squad? It's your boy Darius back at it again with Reincarnated as a Slime, Season 2, Episode 12. Last episode, we had the birth of a demon lord. All that was insane, crazy. So much information to process. So much information that you aren't even able to process because it's like extracurricular knowledge. Like, shouts out Nemesis. I know you wanted to hear that I read your comment, your two comments. Very, very long. Very, very packed with information, just giving the details on exactly what the transformation was, exactly about Noir or Black, how he plays into this, and it's very interesting. Rimuru got a super upgrade. I cannot wait to see where we go from here. This episode's called The One Unleashed. Still no idea what that means. Falmouth is utterly destroyed and gone. We still do have King and Rayheim as prisoners, and... Uh, do we have Rosin? Did we capture Rosin or did we kill him? I don't remember, but we shall see. We shall see. I am very excited. Super ready to hop into this, so I say we just do it. Don't forget, if you guys want early access or full length to this show and all the other shows I'm watching, we are four episodes ahead on Patreon. Links are down in the description, like always, for you guys. Don't forget to subscribe. Click that bell so you guys always know when I post over here on the Dapper channel. Follow all the social medias, Instagram, Twitch, TikTok, Twitter, all at Dapper Darius. Much, much appreciated, y'all. Let's hop into this. Reincarnated as the Slime, Season 2, Episode 12. I always have to check because, yeah, you, you guys know us. Crunchyroll just be doing me dirty with that. Um, the One Unleashed. Let's do this. Hmm. <laughs> okay. To make sure that Rimuru is still in there and everything. It is, a, it is a great password, though. It makes a lot of sense. Episode 36, The One Unleashed. Oh, right back to where we should be. What a beautiful sight to wake up to. Oh my lord. What I would give to wake up to that sight. What more could you ask from a leader to bring you back to life without a single soul left behind? God lord, I would dedicate my life to this man. The slime. <laughs> yeah, right? Wow. And I love the new background for Great Sage. I'm still going to call it Great Sage, but this is insane. Just to make sure. Give us the password, Benny Maru. <laughs> this, is, this is not the time, though. We could have done this in private a second ago, but... <laughs> Yeah, what about my cooking? Benny Maru is dirty for that. Benny Maru is dirty for that. What do we do, Raphael? Is what? <laughs> Benny Maru is set. He could be like, he could be one of those YouTube pranksters. He's funny doing him dirty pass the blame over to Benny Maru smart smart that is a good rebuttal <laughs> how to make sure it's emphasized you told me to <laughs> everybody's out of there That is one of the worst punishments you could do. And she's go she's off. Cook you up a feast. Oh, don't act like you didn't set us up. <laughs> you gained an ability from eating her food. That's so funny. Three days. Ooh, Sufia? Grusius and Albus, right? If I remember the names correctly. <laughs> oh, 
I know you really have no idea in an instant. He was there. Like, how are you going to say Carrion's weak, you know? But Milim is way stronger. I mean, she took out Karibidus in one hit. Hey, I don't think he'll win, but I respect it. It is a shame. I wonder why they're fighting or what causes this. And I didn't realize that was Phobios with us and not Grusius too. That's dope. Grusius is here too, but oh, it's been a minute since I've seen Phobios. Oh my god. That's what I would assume. Not not even physically, but manipulated. Ooh. Royal beast form. The Beastmaster Carrion. Oh, like it was nothing. Oh, she even took on a different form as well. Makes sense why she's very dragon based in her moves and stuff like that. Now knowing that... Okay... The entirety of Eurozania is like gone. Ray, the other demon uh, lord. Let me guess, it was Clayman's. Good, good. No way someone that dope went down that easily. True. Give them some tutelage, Rimaru. <laughs> yes. Progenitor, right? They they called. See, I have a great feeling that there's an ulterior motive to black pre-Diablo, but I need to know what it is. Oh no, is this where the name? Mm, what better of a demonic name than Diablo? Yeah, gonna be spending a lot of magic heals evolving black. Damn, half of this. Hmm, he looks the same. Just a little more dapper. I was about to say, this seems like the exact cave where we originally started. Two years? Enhanced body double. We have like a human form Veldoro? What? 
That is so dope. Oh my lord, that was crazy. Well, that was still going in the up part of the happiness of, of the episodes. We are setting up for some future issues that we have to deal with, some future craziness. But as for right now, still happy, still loving the, the things that were just done. I love the whole password thing from Benny Maru. Make sure Rimuru is still in there. That was a great, funny moment from Shion, Rimuru, and Benny Maru. Absolutely love that. The whole Carrion Milam thing. Definitely Clayman is pulling the strings. I need to know what his goals are and how he was able to manipulate Frey and Milam. Carrion, super dope, super strong. Milam, like he said, is on a whole nother dimension of power. Her combat form was insanely dope. Her name is Milam Nova. I don't think I ever knew her last name. But I think she used, she definitely used the Drago style move this episode i think she used one against Kribidus as well like drago buster or something along those lines which knowing her past and that and that you know fairy tale from um Eryun's village like knowing that backstory it makes a lot of sense you know and why she has dragon wings and all she is half dragon which is insane she is so godly powerful it's not even funny and noir officially turned into diablo this episode like I said, I sense some ulterior motive with him, but I'm hoping for now everything is okay and he is willing to help out because he is a great asset to our squad. We're going to be dealing with... Um, we don't need to really deal with the Western Holy Church right now as long as we free Veldora because he could easily keep the rest of them in check. And we did that in a body double of ourselves to give him like a, uh, a human body to inhabit. And oh my lord, does he look one, super dope, and two, super powerful. Like, I want, like, a friendly sparring session between him and Rimuru, especially after Rimuru's upgrade. I mean, Rimuru has ten times the magicules he had before, which, oh my, like, this is gonna be, it, they're really stepping it up for season two. And I don't know, I know the show itself, at least season two is done. Can you guys confirm or deny it for me? Has season three already been confirmed? Do the light novels keep on going past this? Like, is there enough content for season three, four, five, whatever it may be? Because I am, this is just getting crazier and crazier. I am loving this. I am absolutely loving this. Hopefully you guys are as well. If you are, please leave a like. Let me know your thoughts down below in that comment section. Don't forget to subscribe. Click that Patreon if you guys want early access or full length. Links are down below like always. Check out all the social medias, Instagram, Twitch, TikTok, Twitter, all the Dapper Darius. Much appreciated, y'all. Don't forget to drink some water. Have a great day. Tell someone you love them. Be safe. Peace out, Dapper Squad.